Hi everyone and welcome to Sneha TV capturing happiness and positive energy. So before I go ahead I thought let me give you a brief introduction about myself. So first of all for those who are new to my channel very warm welcome to you and also those who have been around uh, for me I decided to start posting regularly going forward because I am someone who really likes to spread cheer and happy vibes so by profession I'm a happiness coach and a soft skills trainer but uh, I think I wouldn't call it my profession I would call it my passion because I am highly passionate about making a difference to people uh, life is after all going to be more exciting if you have lots of fun so I'm going to be posting a lot of fun stuff as well on this channel so I'm really excited for this ride and uh, of course as a happiness coach I would like to share uh, certain tools and strategies that I use in my life I share with my participants uh, so you know so that you are a whole package and bundle of happiness so that is my aim so let's dive right into the main topic. Welcome to my sister-in-law's wedding. And I was so surprised to see the way she was so calm because I think most of us during our weddings become bridezillas, right? So uh, for me, this was very inspiring to see that this girl was taking care of everything and at the same time, she was so calm. But it was so nice to see all of this so I really thought this was something inspiring and I thought I'd take you through that journey so let's go so my mom dad my sister and myself started discussing the wedding shortly after it happened and we realized right away that all of us had a great time and the only reason was everything was more than perfect during the wedding Let me first introduce you to the bride. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> so that is my sister-in-law Shri Devi for you, my husband's younger sister. Now this girl taught me a lot of life lessons in that short period of time. However, I decided to share with you three lessons that I learned from her and I think every bride to be must watch this video. I guarantee you you will definitely feel inspired to ensure that your wedding is also fun for you. Okay, so the first thing that I saw and I learned from her is being present in the moment. Now, whatever she had done until the day of the wedding, she put her best in arranging for everything, the decor, inviting the guests, the food and all of that. Uh, of course, even her husband played a huge role in it, I'm sure. But I am talking about her because I saw her personally uh, when she was doing all of this. So yeah, coming back to being present, you know sometimes what happens is when we plan something even on the day of the event our mind is running about stuff that we have planned for and we are busy assessing whether everything is going okay or no but what i saw and i learned from her was being in the present moment really really is an awesome way to be during your main day like all the efforts that you've put in is fine but when the wedding is about to begin the celebration is about to begin forget about what happened and forget about everything else that may happen in the future but be in the present moment and totally enjoy your day and trust me it is not that tough a helpful strategy is to focus your attention on your five senses like in her case i was seeing she was enjoying the process of getting ready she really liked her hairstyle she wanted her makeup to be minimal and yet classy and elegant and once the makeup was complete she thanked her beautician she was observing her parents smiling she was really enjoying the food that was being served at the wedding so these are some simple ways in how you can be present in the moment let's move on to number two this i'm deriving from point number one that is being present while being present also start noticing people at your wedding and the second point is being grateful gratitude i saw that she was very grateful for those who came to the wedding and were blessing the couple her and her hubby 
she was grateful that everybody was enjoying the meals everybody was enjoying the ambience she was grateful for the people who made food available for the guests which was so deliciously prepared she was grateful to her friends to her family to her relatives to the pujaris who were performing the rituals for her to the photographers to everything and trust me for those who are watching gratitude is a very very powerful tool one can use in their life so the second point would be to be grateful and the third point is no complaint policy yes she was extremely flexible she wasn't complaining about anything that was not okay she was just having a great time at her wedding i really hope that this video was useful and you enjoyed the wedding with me so yeah this was very inspiring for me this was fun for me i hope you enjoyed watching this video and i will come back soon with another interesting one so till then do comment below uh, if you liked what i shared with you and also do drop a red heart to bless the couple and um, keep coming back subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon for all the notifications okay take care and bye